Hello, Hello guys. guys. So uh, this week we've um, not been working on it too much apart from what you've uh, seen, but we are going to do a sort of technical explanation of what bits we've got so far because we haven't covered it much. You might be hearing us talking about things like navigation board and not actually being able to include what we're talking about, but hopefully in the this week you might have some idea. So uh, we're just going to start off with Andre talking about the error and uh, talk to Right, so uh, Omni has explained his adder, and using that we can make a subtraction. So as you know, we can do subtraction by adding the negative equivalent of a number. And using logic, it's quite easy to do the equivalent of this. If we just uh, simply negate all the bits, so we flip all the ones to zeros and all the zeros to one, then we can uh, reproduce the a minus b by into a minus b plus one. Because of course, when you flip all the bits, you don't get the perfect equivalent in uh, negative. So a zero, for example, goes to minus one. So you get one more, one more, one And uh, so whether it's positive or negative, luckily, you end up with the same thing. You end up with minus b plus 1. Uh, then the carry bit is a bit harder, because if you're trying to, because when you're doing a subtraction, the carry bit is no longer worth plus 1, it's worth minus 1. But luckily, if you flip that 2, then the 0 goes to a plus 1, because the carry bit that was 0 is now being added as a 1. And the bit that was going to be, or was meant to be, subtracted as a 1, goes to zero. So you get your plus one back, which cancels out the minus one we've got here. And so this whole thing returns to be equal to a minus b minus c, which is what we're after. So um, we can do the negation ball in front of the other, and this is in a control bit, because we can also do the um, knots with a zor. So if you do something zor one, you get it knotted back. Uh, so by feeding in the control bit, are we doing a subtraction? We can simply knot everything that gets fed in, and use that to do a subtraction. I'm still using the adder circuit, but I have no other additional hardware. Yeah. So this is this here is the negation board. This one here. Uh, so what we have is the inputs coming along on this, and then these are three different exclusive OR gates, which we use as the conditional knots. So these blue wires along here are carrying the control signals, which is if it's high then what gets outputted will be uh, the inverted version of what's in. So it, um, it's, if it's a subtraction, it's what the control signal signals. On a 1, it says we're doing a subtraction, which will be part of the instruction. Then the uh, output will be knotted, ready for use in the adder. So that then gets gathered back up and outputted down here, with the date carried into the addition boards.